I'm going I'm to set the tone right now. You yes. know what I'm saying? So you just walked in. Turn that Max with me. Yeah. You know, the Max yeah. theme song. This, this is my theme. voice right now. It's Max with me. I've been wanting to do my radio voice for years. Okay. <laughs> so check me out. This will happen. You just walk into the Find a Bay speed dating experience in the Strata. You walk right in. You see the beautiful Strata. You see paintings, everything on the wall. Now when you walk right in, all you see is 20 beautiful women already sitting there prepared for you. For you, D-Lo. For, for you, D-Lo. For you, D-Lo. But then, of course, not just that. I, 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 we oh, got go. the Find the Bay <laughs> Angels are going to be in the building. The Find the Bay Angels, they could just going to be coming around, making sure everybody's having a good time. Smell they like, might give you smell like applesauce. <laughs> <laughs> they might just drop a beautiful, a little Hershey kiss to you, D-Lo. Mm. See, I'm talking to you like this. I used to oh, talk Lord, to man. men like this. But D-Lo, you need to hear this. And all the listeners need to hear this. Yes, so when you walk in, five minutes, you get five minutes with each of these beautiful women. Because let's be honest, you get a good vibe for somebody. So at the end of the evening, because D-Lo, they all 20 of them going to want you. No oh, doubt. 20 of them. 20 going to want 20 you. Up. The next day, we're going to send you an email and say, these were your mutual interests. And oh. all of us going to say, we love D-Lo. We yeah. love D-Lo. That's yeah. only what we want. Okay. So you need to come up. Okay. Okay, there you go, D. Let's see that theme music and everything. Oh, yeah. But real talk, everybody needs to come out. It's going to be a wonderful time. Like I said, we got 20 women already signed up. We got about 10 people on the waiting list. The door is breaking down for the ladies. So, fellas, come out. Come out. What's the cost? The cost is um, it's $20 to be a dater. And general admission, like not to be a dater, but just to come in and, you know, feel the experience or whatever is $10. <clears throat> So you have one fee for those that actually want to participate, and we have another fee for those gawkers. Exactly. Right. Exactly. Gawkers. <laughs> gawkers, <man. laughs> gawkers. On the line. Look the floor. Wall. Um, hey, look. Holding up the wall. The term is uh, the gentleman admission. 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 Gentleman admission
Mm-hmm. That's that's why it's show comedy shows. Getting to my last comedy show. Yep. And they, they still together. They've been together for about what five months now. They oh, met and they met at the thing, man. So that's what I'm saying. You want to come and meet you somebody. You ain't got to sit up watching Netflix alone. alone man, right. what? Yeah. You come meet you somebody and, and have a a, a a relationship. Now I'm not really good at relationships. Women, I tell them, don't fall in love with me. I have four references to prove it. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> <laughs> Call these numbers and find out what's oh, going on. Man. <laughs> you will help them do their research. I would call her, 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 and her, and they're going to take, no, nah, I believe them, yeah. Yeah. I ain't a bitch. So how'd you all come up with this? This is, uh, I've heard of it before. Uh, yeah. You know, partner, get it. Uh, well, um, I was in a, a singles group on um, Facebook, and a, um, myself and a couple other ladies in the group had said something about speed dating for the group, and that idea stayed there in that post. So um, one day I was, you know, sitting, and I'm like, maybe I could put something together myself. So I had uh, sent Deshaun a, me- Deshaun a message, because I know he's, uh, he has a lot of connections and everything. No, and everybody. Like, single yeah. man? Yeah. He, he has a, a lot of connections. I'm a single man. I don't say she was single, too. <laughs> he was, he was a music box tonight. <laughs> so I pitched the idea to him, and, like, from that instance, he was just all for it. So, and we just... We just went with it, and um, we ran with it. We took off, and here we are right now with the second one. So, um, yeah. And just to piggyback off of that, see this lady right here, we used to work together, and we just became best friends. I'm talking about nine years. Really? That is the homie right there. Nine years of friendship. So when that homie, when she said, let's do this, it was instant fire. Because one thing I do is I'm intense on everything that I love. You know what I'm saying? So when she brought it to the table, we've been rocking ever since. Where did you guys meet? What's your job? Uh, we worked at the Census Bureau. Oh, really? Yeah, during the uh, 2010 decennial. Oh, okay. Decennial. Yeah. That's it's called decennials? Yeah. Census words. I never heard it before, decennial. Yeah, she went deep on the day. Yeah, she went deep on the day. She like, yeah, she went deep on the day. Is that Arsenio Hall's brother? Oh, man. <laughs> So the 2010 decennial, the next decennial will be when? 2020. Is it called decennial as well? It's called no, a centennial. It's I'm it's just messing with you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. That's 100. It's called the, the, the lily. Decalini. Decalini. Oh, man. Y'all wild tonight. That's something, something. So, so that's pretty cool. So you guys have met and you made your business work. Now, has there been a relationship thing you guys? Ab- oh, absolutely. Lord. This is like... This nah, is like absolutely not. You forgot yeah. to say absolutely not. Absolutely, <laughs> absolutely not. Man, hey, y'all, somebody <laughs> lied up. <laughs> yeah, absolutely, absolutely not. Absolutely not. Hold on. Let's make it clear here. Hold on. Let's make it clear here. But no, we, we, we've we never had any romantic feelings towards each other. It's like he's my brother from another mother. Or whatever, but um. She got emotional. We talking. Did y'all see that? Did he, did he get caught up in, in a storm called the, the the friendship storm? Right. And I can't get out. Man. Nah, man. And we and we were so you know we're so close that people do question it. Like, are they going together? Or when are y'all getting married? And it's like, no, no, no. This is like my man, brother. Look, let me like, tell you. I'm gonna tell my you birthday something. is July fifteenth. Tell me yours. Mine's the tenth. You said it. Yeah. Hers the twenty second. Oh, really? We all cancers. Yep, yep. So we, we, we can all cry together. We're so emotional. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. Because when he's angry, I'm angry. And when something happened to me, he's angry. And it's, yes. it's just... I, and it will have me around angry because I'll turn into the Hulk. <laughs> <laughs> I've got right, Wonder right. Twins, man. Yeah. That's all Absolutely. right. That's cool. You know what? And I will say this. I will say this. Women are dope to hang around with. Oh, so yeah. I, I see your relationship because mm-hmm. some of my best jokes are made up around really creative dudes or just women in general. You gotta be a creative dude who's open to creativity. But women laugh easier than guys do. No yeah. So I think a, a creative dude laugh and no joke's gonna work, or a woman laugh. Mm-hmm. But some some guy who's like, I'm a police officer, I'm a this, no, joke's gonna work. Man, my uncle told me when I was five years old, your best friend to have was a woman. He said, you, you can have your boy. You but was five? A, five? I don't even know why he said it. Fresh out of diapers. I don't even know what he meant by that. <laughs> but I know now, you know what I'm saying? Because they give you the real, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. I have some women who are very, I'm very, very close with, who are my exceptional friends. So, That's what's up. I get it. I get it. And you know what's cool, though? When you get to that point in your life when every female you meet, you ain't trying to sleep with. Say what? That say is the what? worst thing about being a man. You get to that life finally, that point in your life, you say, okay. You can see them for who they are, not we're just We're friends and we're not... Right. Although you fam, we just gonna be friends. So, Mike, sure. when did you get to that level? 
yesterday. No, <laughs> <Yes. laughs> yes. yes. no, no, really, really a long time ago. My, one of my best friends have been friends with since second grade. Okay. okay. She's a female, very attractive. She's been friends since second grade. So did you ever try to get her? Never. Or did you get caught in a friend store? No, we uh -huh. just, we just, she's my closest friend. I just, I just, I just, mm, just friends. And it's last one, I'm telling you, I got five references <laughs> to prove it's not going to work. I'm a great boyfriend, great daddy. Oh, I can dance. We like we have a great time. I love the movies. I treat most of the time, but I don't want to get serious. Mm. Yeah, that's understandable. That's respectful. I mean, you got to be honest. So would, 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 the, would the speed dating be a good deal for you? It's a good thing because it takes five minutes, five minute dates. Five minute dates. I holiday. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Love you. Yeah, Gotta no, go. yeah, I mean, I don't really want that thing. And you can even watch me date someone else. All right. <laughs> yeah. He, yeah. he was at our first one. He was one of the most requested. I'm going to tell you that. Believe it. He was one of the most requested. Because I look like Morris Chestnut. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, no. so, so they get the request when they want to date? Well, yeah. Like I said, they'll email. We'll send them. They have a mutual interest card. So they kind of mark off. If he was number three. They like number three. They mark it off. And they give all the cards to her at the end of the evening. Okay. So she's going through the cards, and they just saying, Mike Bonner, Mike Bonner, Mike Bonner. We're like, a wow. A.K.A. Morris Chestnut, a.k.a. Morris Cheesy. <laughs> so so uh, at the speed dating, they can't request who they want to date. But afterwards, they it's like a comment card or a survey card. They yeah, can, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, afterwards? Yeah, they have a Y'all ain't let me know what was going on. Yeah, they yeah, like yeah. me? Well, yeah. well, well, see, the problem with you, man, let, let's really talk. He came late. Yeah, yeah see, yeah, I put yeah, him out there. You know what I'm saying? He missed the first two rounds. Yeah. yeah exactly. I remember. Yeah, I did. <laughs> yeah. I so, get requests, though? Oh, you got requests. So the yeah. first really? round, wow. so the first round, Low self -esteem. you date whoever is in front of you or <laughs> yeah. you can choose. Oh, yeah, it's, it's like we, we, have all the, we have all the ladies seated. And so we'll sit all the guys in front of the ladies. So when we start, the five minutes start, you get five minutes to interact with that person. Once the five minutes is up, all the guys will stand up and they will shift one seat down and then so, start with the next person over but you will have a sheet in front of you so if it's somebody that you do like you can say okay um i like rebecca she had a pink shirt on or um okay so this was susan susan had the long earrings mm -hmm. and then at the end i like you just say like applesauce <laughs> <laughs> yeah or applesauce pizza. she made me hungry. <laughs> I'm hungry and on the back of the sheet you can let us know who you were interested in so then with them about two days, you'll get an email from me saying, hey, so-and-so is interested in you. Here's their contact information. Mm. And then at that point, if you choose to reach out, you can. And if not, that's fine, too. Sounds oh. like a scary way to ask a I girl. I want some reach out. I want to reach out said for Mike Bonner, huh? <laughs> I touched you on your shoulder. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to cut everybody off, but uh, somebody right now in this room already signed up. For speed dating. Okay. There was a gentleman that y'all just had on the radio. Cornbread. Yes, sir. Cornbread, I'm the speed dater. Uh, corn. So, ladies, let me tell you about Cornbread. If we talked about, I'm gonna put him out there. Wonderful music producer. Yes. This man is world renowned, international. So, ladies, I told you, I got y'all. Y'all want to meet Cornbread? Yeah. He's coming here. He doing this doo wop. Y'all want to meet him? Yeah, tall. Officer Glenn. Experienced <laughs> brother. Good brother. Yes, yeah, he's really nice. Mm -hmm. yeah, I got. We got y'all, ladies. We got y'all, fellas. We got y'all. Come on out. You can um, email 